I was speaking with a young man about a dating situation and it was getting a little frustrating. You see, this was the second round. They had gone out previously quite a number of times. This was the second time that they were now going out again and he kept getting stuck. He kept getting stuck and couldn't make a decision. On the one hand, she has this quality and that quality. On the other hand, she has, doesn't have this and doesn't have that. And at a certain point, I turned to this young man. I said, you know what we need? We need Elio Hanovi. We had a prophet. If we had a prophet here, this prophet would tell us, is it that you just don't feel that she's the right one? Meaning maybe she's not the one made for you and you're not feeling that natural sense of comfort? Or is it that you know she's the right one, but there's something else that's inhibiting you? If we had Elio Hanovi here, he would tell us the answer. At which point this young man in a quiet voice said, no, she is the right one for me, but I'm angry at Hashem for it. I said, what? Stop. What'd you say? Say it louder. And he said the same words again. She is the right one for me, but I'm angry at Hashem for it. And this fellow had uncovered one of the great truths that I find over and over in the Shidduch scene. Many a time a young man or young woman finds the right person, but they won't move forward. Why? Because she's not pretty enough, he's not smart enough, they don't come from a good enough family, or a whole host of other reasons why I will not accept this one. The comfort level is there, <clears throat> internally they feel it's right, but I can't accept it because, and they have their whole host of reasons why it's not what I'm looking for, not what I want, they drop her or him, go on with their lives. If you are ready <clears throat> to remain single, for many, many years, then you should go ahead with that course. But if you would like to find the one that's right for you, that's not a very wise course. You see, Hashem never handcuffs a person to a result. Hashem doesn't force you to find the right one. And rare it is that a person finds the right one and poof, lightning strikes, thunderworks, and instantly they know. There's not supposed to be total infatuation. There's supposed to be a comfort level, supposed to be a level of understanding. You did the paper test, you checked them out, and now there's a certain level of comfort, of natural clicking. That's a sign that she or he is your bashert, and that's the time to move forward.